What's good, everybody? It's Eric back with another video. Got a quick little unboxing here for you guys. Uh, got some fan mail, some uh, some something I ordered like a long time ago that's finally arrived. Um, but before we go any further, you know, make sure you hit that like, subscribe, share, you know, on all platforms, Twitter, Instagram. Follow me at damn underscore Eric. That's damn underscore U-R-C-C. Thank you very much. Um, I do want to give a quick shout out to everybody who's been supporting me um everybody's been sharing the stuff uh everybody who's you know just been helping me out with everything you know i appreciate it you know i didn't think i was going to be starting a youtube now or whatever or ever but uh you know funny how things work but thanks again anyway um so let me start off right here I got a package from the funko cop you can see the funko cop uh cool dude very cool dude i'm um, glad i met him Met him through uh, my bro Ricky, my coworker Ricky. Hey, what's up, guys? Um, yeah, he, I, I, like I said previously, I was looking for Green Lantern. Well, any type of, well, mainly the John Stewart, because I, I just love John Stewart Green Lantern. That's the one I grew up with from uh, Justice League Unlimited, as y'all probably remember. I have the, um, I did one of my first videos was the animated stuff. So, um, yeah, he sent, he found John Stewart after I made that video. He um, hit me up. And he was like, you know, you want me to pick it up? I was like, well, heck yeah. I was like, yeah, I was like, yeah, please. And uh, also told him that, uh, if he ever wanted anything, you know, to uh, I, I'd look out for him too. And uh, I picked him up today, actually, this Gundam kit. I got it for you, bro. I'm going to send it out to you. Don't you worry. You're going to get it. But yeah, it's just, it's just awesome how, um, you know, I haven't even been doing this a while and I'm already starting to like, you know, uh, be recognized by some people, if not my, just, just my peers, you know, and it's just, uh, it's just a great feeling, you know, have people look out for you, you know, and stuff, you know, put you on. And I also met another great, um, creator out there. His name's JC, JC the Great. Uh, he was also very nice to me, you know, uh, checked out a couple of his videos. Make sure y'all, by the way, y'all need to go check these dudes out. I'm making sure their the links to their channels are in the description. That's the Funko Cop, uh, Ricky, Ricky Dones, uh, JC the Great. You know, he told me to come through for a stream. I for, dang, I forgot the, the YouTuber's name. Oh my goodness, I'm, I my I'm, I'm, I apologize, but I'm I'm make sure all his, his information is down in the description too. But yeah, they came through the stream, shouted me out in the stream. I know, yeah, it's just nothing but love. But let me just crack up, crack open this, uh, this box here. You know, it's funny. I went to go pick up that gun, that, that Gundam for bro. And um, I went to go, go, uh, went to go get it yesterday. Today, at the time of recording, it's April 5th. And I did not know. <laughs> I don't know. I just forgot it was Easter. And then I pulled up, drove 30, drove 30 minutes to Target. And then just find out they were closed. But anyway, we, we, we got you though. Here he is. John Stewart Green Lantern from, I think this is from, yeah. From Justice League Unlimited, the ball version. At first, I was kind of skeptical about getting this because I already got, you know, the other line and these are a bit taller. But, you know, I don't care. Anything Jon Stewart related, I want it. I want the other one, too, that, um, I think it's the Rebirth design. Him in it. It comes with that, uh, same wave as Bizarro. I'll get that another time. There you go. Crack it open real quick. So, what I'm thinking about doing... Once I get them out there, hopefully I don't cut myself. They got this. I always put, put them with plastic in here, man. I can't get it open. I got the saw it. Yeah. Yeah. So I got <laughs> uh, get them out the packaging. We get the, the constructs. What's Green Lantern? What else? Construct, right? Uh, a second. All right, we Gucci. All right, stood out on the floor for now. You already know he come. He come with a stand and a little baseball card or whatever. Uh, here he is. Out of the packaging. Oh my, he a little bit top heavy. You know, I like this joint though. I just wish you know. 
you know, obviously, you know, it's, it's kind of, but, but you know, it's one of their first few figures. I think, I think they're starting to get better, better, uh, McFarlane listening to feedback. Well, like, cause I think I got that Superman over there and you know, his hand is like a different color, but I think they changed it on the, uh, the next couple of Supermans they released. Let me put the constructs on. How do you put this thing on his head? I don't know. I don't know how to put this little eyepiece on. But he does come with a, a gun the construct. Looks like a cannon or something, but just flows right on in his arm. Like so like let me see. Uh yeah, there we go. It kind of doesn't stay unless I'm just not forcing it in there enough. But no, nah, let me stop. Yeah, there. Oh my goodness. How do you get this thing on? I can't get this thing on his arm. It's supposed to go like, you know, you know, he's like when he makes the something from the ring, it's supposed to be like a gun, and then he has like the little like the scouter or whatever, like targeter. I'll put him I'll, I'll you'll you'll see him in this in the comparison with the other thing I got. Hold on. But yeah, I'm thinking about taking that the gun and putting on my DC Essentials Green Lantern. But thanks again, uh, Funko Cop. Oh, wait, hold on. I almost forgot. He gave one of the homies a stickers. Okay, hold on. Make sure I go check him out, please. He does great. He does good work. Him and his, you know, he does the little vlogs. He got his, his daughter in the back. They, they so cute, man. They, I just, like I said, I appreciate this so much, man. It's just like... Now, here's something I ordered from Hasbro Pulse damn near three months ago. No, six months ago. Almost half a year ago. All right. It was up there for a limited time. Got it from Hasbro Pulse. Some of y'all know who this is or what this is. But when stuff on Hasbro Pulse go up, ooh, look, it looks so good. Oh, my goodness. Y'all don't know. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Y'all ready? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The 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 co what is this? The the Snake Supreme Cobra Commander. Look at the oh, look at the packaging. Look at the look at that real real special edition. Real limited. Real limited. Yeah, hold on, hold on. Let's let's get them open. Oh no. Oh, look at the, look at the box. Oh, look at your boy. Look at your, he looks straight pimping. Straight pimping. Pimping. Look at this. Oh my God. Look, I don't even, they don't, look at, I'm about to, ain't no tires or nothing in here. I can pull them right out the packaging. Oh yeah, let's, let's get it. Let's get it. Hold on, I'm going to sit that down right there. Look at you. Bruh. Most of y'all who at least are toy to, uh, collectors, right? Y'all know that the G.I. Joe, like the six inch line, was a pain in the you know what to find. Man, everything from Target, Walmart, uh, what else? What else? Walgreens, everything sold out. People was hiding stuff, people was waiting in the parking lot at 6 a.m. And, and and buying up half the, the daggone peg and you getting there and you left with uh either either something you already got like the roadblock or scarlet or just nothing nothing at all i was fortunate to get a few i'm gonna show y'all the rest of that when i um do the full in-depth review of this but he look, he look at the sculpting on the the chest and everything you know he got the gold and the red see i was like i want cobra commander but i want him to be the damn Cobra Commander, you know what I'm saying? He got, he got, he got, you know, mm. I don't want to, you know, that, that little, the Navy blue joint, the regular one is all right. Even that little one where he running, but this joint right here, mm, 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 mm. look at the cape, the, the cape even got the, the snake print. Pimpin'. <laughs> Pimpin'. All right. But I'm going to cut, I'm going to uh, show y'all comparison. I'm going to even show y'all the, uh, the John Stewart and everything. All right. So here's the Cobra Commander Supreme. Well, Cobra Commander Snake Supreme, excuse me, out of the packaging. See him, I got him in this pose. He's holding the globe here. And then he's got the, here's a look at this gun. 
comes with like a he comes with a sidearm, you know, the globe. This is actually a spare hand. I think I can switch. Yeah, you can switch this out for a fist in hand. I don't know where that joint just went, but <laughs> uh, let me see here. All right, like so, like that. Got the fist of hands, and then like, like I said, the, just the detail of it. This the cloth cape with the the snake print. The gold on the, the the look at the I don't know who sculpted that but that's that's pretty damn nice on well, him right there if I do say so myself he got the boots you know what I'm saying he just dripped out he just dripped out I'm probably gonna pose him like um holding the uh pointing hands you're gonna get it. Like, nah. Where's that? It's a dope fig overall. I mean, I had to have this one at least for the GI. When when I was doing the whole GI Joe craze, like I said, it was it was extremely still is actually hard to find some of these figures. Um, that's why I'm kind of I'm kind of basically done with this way. I mean, yeah, here we get, he get the sword here and the sheath that goes with it. Put that in there. But yeah, after after this cover command, I'm. Uh, I mean, I want I want Zartan, but that's about it. Other than that, I mean, I I, I kind of grew up with GI Joe. I didn't grow up with the original, obviously, because I'm I'm too damn young. But I did see um some of the reruns of the original. Uh, there was the um they had Sigma Six actually GI Joe Sigma Six. They came on like four kids like back in like the mid two thousands. I used to watch. Oh, he comes with the scepter. I forgot to mention too. Um, I like how the throne is, you know what I'm saying? Like, like I'm gonna just keep him right here on the throne. And then we're gonna have actually I got Ray Ninja. This is just a few I have like right here. Let me do a side by side comparison, matter of fact, while I'm <laughs> while I'm right here. Um uh, yeah, I got this uh Ray Ninja, the Pimp Destro. And then I was lucky to get this Baroness too, with the uh with the motorcycle here. I don't really, now that I got it, I don't really use the motorcycle. It's just, eh, just man to me, you know. I prefer like a traditional motorcycle, but this is all the Copa figures I got right here. Um, probably going to change them to display background, but I am going to keep the box like that, though. But yeah, um, yeah, I used to watch uh, the Sigma 6 on 4Kids. Uh, I had a few of the figures. A couple of my buddies had some. Uh, what else did he used to? Oh, I had the GI Joe Spy Troops, the Spy Troop line from like 05 too. I had a uh, the 12 inch scale, like Snake Eyes and uh, Snake Eyes and Storm Shadow, Storm Shadow, yeah, Storm Shadow. And it came with like a movie and stuff. Uh, other than that, I mean, I've been really familiar with GI Joe, obviously the movies, but you know, I actually got a couple of those uh, the little three three quarter ones from the movie, from the movie line. Let me actually get the rest of these figures out here for you. And so here is everything on my newly reorganized G.I. Joe shelf. Uh, start over here with the Joes. We got Duke, Roblox back there, the, tar the Target exclusive Roblox, Beachhead, and we got Snake Eyes up front. Then we go into the Cobras, and we got the Cobra Commander Supreme. Sound like a menu item. Hey, give me that Cobra, Cobra, that Cobra Commander Supreme. <laughs> but uh, I got the Red Ninja. This was a pain in the butt to get. I know. Oh, my goodness. I was lucky to get him. Same thing with the Baroness back there. And I think I found this this uh, Pimp Daddy Destro just sitting on the shelf at, like, uh, GameStop, I think. Which, yeah. That's going to be everything but the G.I. Joe shelf. Oh, let me show you how I worked in the John Stewart down here. Thanks to the Funko Cop. Thanks again, bro. Your Gundam is coming. Um, probably gonna ship it out tomorrow. And uh, yeah, so this is, this is like the uh, unlimited look, Justice League Unlimited. And that's the like the regular Justice League from like season one to two, basically. So I worked that in nice. Shelf hasn't really changed much. Just reshuffled some people around. I used to have Mister Freeze up on the stand, but I took it off for something else. I think yeah, for all that DC stuff over there, I took it off. And that's pretty much going to be it for today's video. Uh, leave a comment, subscribe. Thanks for watching and peace.